So I'm gonna continue, here's another video, but my videographer needed some help. So once again, for the capital letter F, you're gonna curve at the top line, come down, and then you're gonna go to the left and come across straight. So once again, the first step is to curve, just like this, pick up your pencil, come down, out to the left and over. And it looks like this. And then the lowercase looks just like the ones that you know from before. Since all of you know how to do it, since I taught you guys before we left, it's a loop up to the top, down through the baseline, coming back up to the right, out for a short arm. So if I were to use this, I would say Fred, since we all know who Fred is, and see how the line connects to the R. And then I'm gonna say Fred flew far. Okay, so this is the capital letter, how it curves to the next one, and then you would do the lowercase one here. Now, the next one, G, play, pay very close attention to this one. This one is pretty difficult in a capital letter. To make a capital G, you start at the baseline, you curve up to the top line. Then you make a small loop and bring it to the other side of the top line. Then you curve again and down to the baseline. The last step is from the baseline, you're gonna make a curve that goes through like this. So if I do it fast, I'll do it slow one more time. Curve up for a loop, up for a loop, down and over. This G is really fancy, but it's the way that our book wants us to show you. Just like this. And then you know how to do a lowercase, because I taught you that before. So if I were to write the word giraffe, it would be like this. Okay, look for some more recursive review coming up.